Hi to Chaco. It's going to be a great game. It's just a best of one here. Four teams of two players. Uh, it's a random hero. Random race. We have a great... No, Altar here. Altar here for Foggy. Foggy got Night Elf. Wait, is it a random race? No, it's not a random race. It's just a random hero. They can choose the race. So everyone is their own race. Like uh, Orc Worker is Orc. Foggy is uh, Night Elf. Here we have uh, Chamiko playing as human. We have Lucifer playing as undead. Cash as orc. Hawk as human. Sawin as orc. And Loliat as human. So um, we have one undead in the game. We have one, two, three. Three humans in the game. We have one, two, three. Three orcs and one night elf. Yeah, I mean, I can count. I've learned to count in high school, of course. Oh, some more wisps here. We do have a demon, uh, shadow hunter. Okay, it's a random hero. I've got already. <laughs> shadow hunter here for uh, Foggy, and his ally. He got a warden. Okay, shadow hunter warden. What a super combo here for Team Foggy Worker. Here we have a keeper and uh, you know a warden as well, but a warden with the keeper not that much of a super combo. Uh, here we have a warden, a warden, and a we don't know yet. A warden here for Hawk. Everyone, every team is getting a warden. Lucifer doesn't have a hero yet. What do we have here for Chamiko? A uh, Fire Lord. Okay. Maybe Team uh, Lucifer and Chamiko is the only team that doesn't get a warden. There's a Fire Lord. Is this a warden? There's a Blade Master. Blade Mask and a Fire Lord. What a super combo. This Fire Lord is harassing, going for the Wisps. Or is he going for the Wisps? He is going for the Wisps. He's just attacking them with his uh, his little attack thing. And uh, this Wisp goes into the gold mine. Meanwhile, over here, the Shadow Hunter crept this already. He is already. No, it's close to level 2. It's Shakti Lar, by the way. He's going to defend against the Fire Lord. I'm not sure what skill the. Wait, the Fire Lord used some mana already. What skill did he even uh, pick? Did he pick soul burn? Did, is, has he been soul burning wisps? Or did he creep something with lava spawns? No, he had, doesn't have XP. 25, he got one wisp. What did you did he use his man on? Like soul burn? Or no, no, maybe it's that attack where uh, he does... Uh, I forgot the name of the skill. What's the name of the skill? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> when it burns uh, whatever he attacks. We have a beast master here with the, the piggies. These uh, piggies are looking extra cute today. They have like a different, uh, they look different than normal. We have headhunters. Oh, this uh, Fire Lord is going for the more wisps here. Oh, by the way. Oh, oh no, I already knew that. The Blade Master, of course, we knew that already. He is, uh, oh, he finds some headhunters. Beast ma okay, Beast Master blade against Blade Master, just like we see normally. Skeletons here uh, for Lucifer. Doing some damage. Meanwhile, here the... the Fire Lord is being my put back. What is Chamiko even doing? He's just fast attacking. Incinerate. Yes, that's the uh, name of the spell. Incinerate. Probably Soul Burned and another Wisp suicide to dispel the Soul Burn plus the mana. Uh, burn mana. Maybe. Forces are under attack. Okay, well, this Fire Lord. Attacking this uh, this archer a little bit. Look at those attacks on that archer. Oh, the grunt here for a worker. Gonna help out his ally. And the warden as well. <laughs> Level 3 warden already. This fire lord is so dead. So, oh, he does have lava spawn. It probably got uh, dispelled by the wisp or something earlier. The fire lord has fallen. And, uh, well, Chamiko has towers. He will have to rely on towers and a lava spawn. But no one's attacking him. Don't worry, guys. Chamiko is gonna be just fine. Lucifer with the blade mash and the fiend's also doing fine. We have uh, Team Sawin and Loliath creeping. Uh, there's an expansion for them. There's an expansion here for Team uh, Foggy. No expansion yet for Team Chai, Miko, Lucifer. Uh, there's an expansion here for Team Cash. There's a second expansion, in fact. Hawk already has an expansion up. Oh, what's this uh, G, G Giant Hunter doing here? He is just dying so fast to the Grunts and the Warden. Lava spawn is going to scout a little bit. The warden, what does he get here? 
What a death sound. It's so beautiful. At some point, I'll be able to mimic even that death sound. This warden also level 3. This keeper level 3. But this warden might have fan of knives. But this warden over here, she's... Uh, where is she even? Was it... Uh, no, this is the other warden. So many wardens. Where's the warden of uh, Hawk? Oh, here she is. She's also level 3. Oh, town is under siege. Look at this attack here for Team Sawin. Sawin and uh, Loliat. On the base of Orc Worker, who gets a Blade Master second. Warden Blade Master, but Blade Master is totally entangled and surrounded here by Footman and uh, laughed at. And is he just dead or can he? Yeah, I mean, he's dead. A fast tech to Fortress here for Worker. Uh, we see Blade Master, 88 critical strike. Mikasa is Mikasa's Blade Master, by the way, for Lucifer. Didn't realize it was Mikasa. I thought it was just a normal Blade Master. There's Shadow Hunter here for Foggy. He's still only level 2. But look at these footmen and these grunts just making sure. Oh, Warden against Warden fight. There's Shadow Strike level 2. Shadow Strike on the Warden. How does it feel to be Shadow Struck, Warden? Now you know how everyone else feels. This Warden is just creeping. We have uh, the Blade Master and the Fire Lord also just creeping. Uh, what? The Book of the Dead was used here by Lucifer at some point to do something. Oh, the warden gets shadow struck again. Where is, is there entangled? No, she just TPs out. No, the Kodo here, but archers. Defensive play here by team uh, Foggy Worker. The Blade Master is back. Wait, no. What? Was it a different Blade Master? I thought it was Orc Worker's Blade Master. I heard the Blade Master. See some grunts running. Uh. The buy one from the tavern. Is there a tavern? There's a tavern all the way in the center. Oh, there he is. Oh, it was, uh, it was Foggy's Blade Master, not Orc Worker. I saw a red Blade Master. I didn't know it was actually uh, Foggy's Blade Master. He's going for the, uh, the Footman. Footman takes a bit of damage. The shop was killed. There's a fan of knives. Was that level one? It looks like level one. Oh, and she gets uh, entangled and ha laughed at. And of course, she uh, laughs back because she's a warden. She used a fan of knives, doesn't have blink. And there, the warden dies, but the other warden. He survives to use a great healing potion. Blade Master goes wind walk. And oh, oh, he is uh, he's, he's going to die though. He, he's just dead. This is dead Blade Master. And Archer died somewhere there. And Archer dies. The Kota here is taking a lot of damage. And here's an attack on Team uh, on Foggy as well. Foggy, team Foggy is just being torn apart. But here is an attack of cash on Lucifer. So maybe Team Lucifer has to retreat here in a moment because their base is being attacked. But, uh, yeah, Team Foggy, can they stay alive here? Foggy last time in the FFA was also being attacked by all sides. So maybe Foggy is just someone that attracts uh, attracts aggressive play from other players. And uh, a lot of beautiful talk here. I'm not sure what they're saying exactly, but here. Oh, TP here for Lucifer. The Blade Master is flying. The Headhunters, they're still just Headhunters. When are they going to be Berserkers? Not anytime soon, because he's still a tier 2. Beastmaster takes a lot of damage, but he has more flying uh, skills. He uses it on the Blade Master. Uh, Mortar team. Oh, Chamiko went for mass. Mortar team. Beautiful play by Chamiko. He will kill these buildings so fast. The Fire Lord is so powerful. Uh, Foggy's base is dead, but uh, they did survive over here. Oh, a little bit. Okay, not really. It seems like Team Foggy uh, Orc Worker is behind so far in this game. There's a surround on the Blade Master. He does have mana to get out, though. Mikasa. He's not like that Blade Master of Foggy. I'm not sure what his name was, but. Tree of Life being rebuilt. Mortar teams, you know, they are great against Dryads. And what do we see here? Dryads against Mortar teams. Six Mortar teams, and they see the Dryads and they're like, oh, walking toes of XP. Look at these attacks. I'm pretty sure they have uh, the tier 3 upgrade. One Mortar team gets staffed out. Uh, fragmentation shard, I mean. And, uh, you know, all the drives are dead, of course, as expected. Foggy is in trouble. His ally cannot cannot really help him. He doesn't even have any heroes. He's just killing everything. Lucifer. He has the orb on the Blade Master now. Going for the Warden. The Warden has to be super duper careful. She has a TP. And she has Shadow Strike. Okay, Mikasa. Still alive. Warden also still alive. And, uh... I'm not sure Lucifer, uh, I'm not sure if he should be fighting here now. But there's a Death Knight third for Cash. And a Dark Ranger here for Hawk. I'm not sure what Hawk has been doing all this time. Has he just been creeping or 
He wasn't fighting with any anyone, right? We see Sowin. He has mass raiders. He's creep. He's uh, creeping over there. Okay. Well, Lucifer does TP out. And uh, great. Birdie over there. It seems Tamiko just keeps pushing, but the Shredder is killing his uh, mortar teams. He does get the expansion, and one more mortar team dies. Team Orc, Worker, Foggy, they only have one base between the two of them. One base. But most other teams have like four bases. Right? Four bases for Team Hawk and uh, Hawk and Cash. Four bases for Team Sowin and Loliath. Three bases for Team Lucifer and Chamiko. And Team Foggy, one base. They're building two more bases. At least Foggy's trying to uh, replenish his bases with more trees of lives. So cleaving here by Lucifer. Oh, but here comes Team Sawin again. Seems like uh, Foggy's just Team Foggy is just always an easy target in two for in uh, FFA. They're just creeping. They're just creeping Foggy. This warden is dead, and uh, this warden is level five. In this base now. Oh, thanks even for Loliath. He's he's becoming a better and more truer human player with each game. Getting tanks in FFA. Blade Master, by the way, is a Kigami. He's level one. Seems like Team Orc Worker is pretty dead here. The footman, the tanks, the everything. Dark Ranger is creeping over here. Of course, Hawk won last week in the FFA. Hawk is so good in this FFA matches. You can see it again. Hawk, what does he even have? He has footman, guys. Hawk has footman. What do you guys even see at the bottom right? Actually, I just now realized. But you guys don't see anything. It looks pretty broken. A player's force so let me hide that. Oh. There. Well, we have a fight here. We have uh, Griffins. Okay, Hawk goes for Griffins, not Hawks. I mean, it doesn't make much sense. He's Hawk. He should go for Hawk. Well, it's fine. These mortar teams doing a lot of damage to these uh, berserkers and everything else, but not to the griffins. Oh no, the griffin gets wept. Oh, there's a piggy. There's some more uh, mortar team attacking. The blade master is pretty low. Uh, uh, Orc worker GG's out. I mean, we we knew they were losing there at the top side of the map. The death knight here is. Uh, oh, we have a death knight for Lucifer, by the way. Against the death knight of Cash, the death knight of Lucifer dies. They're retreating. Meanwhile, uh, Foggy is still in the game, isn't he? Yeah, Foggy is going to win this game in by himself. One versus two versus two versus two. Foggy might lose his tree here. Does Sawin have pillage? Yes, he has pillage. Sawin definitely has pillage. There goes the tree of life. There's only one base here for Foggy, but he can still make this comeback. There's another base. Oh, cannon tower, guys. Lolite even building cannon towers. He is a more more of a human player than any other human player I've seen in my life. These tanks are one to upgrade it. Go for this ancient of, ancient of war. Hey, the shadow hunter gets ensnared. The shredder. Oh, there's a secret uh, exit here. Oh, but this, he tries to escape, but he can't because the shred, uh, shredder is ensnared. And even if he did escape, I mean, he's gonna lose all his buildings. He says GG. He tries to fight. He could maybe win this fight with some superb micro with the Shadow Hunter and the Shredder. But it seems like he, even Foggy doesn't have the micro here to win this fight. And Foggy is defeated. Team Foggy is out. And we're down to three teams. There's a ha 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 on a wisp. A warden level three. Well. There. Team Red is out. So we have Team Light Blue, Team Blue, and Team Yellow. What's the highest level hero on the map? We have a level 4 Blade Master. Do we have any level 5 heroes? I think here we have a Warden who is level 5.5. Warden for Loliath who is level 3. The Keeper is level 5. They got two Wardens. I just now realized they have two Wardens. Both team, uh, both team member has a Warden. Uh, one got a word in first, the other one got a word in second. A player's forces are under attack. And what about Team Hawk? Do I, do I have uh, high level heroes? The Beastmaster is still level 4. The Warden level 4. Uh, so only, it seems like only Team Blue, 
Team Serene has level 5 uh, heroes, a level 5 Warden and level 5 Keeper. I'm gonna creep some more. The Keeper doesn't really want the XP, but the Warden does. And, uh, oh, here's an attack on the Necropolis. Necropolis. Oh, we have Witch Doctors, Master Witch Doctors. We have Griffins, 2 0 upgraded Griffins. Can team Lolite, uh, uh, can team Chamico, Lucifer, defend this. They do have mortar teams, right? The tanks should be no problem. Four tanks. Who cares? We have so many mortar teams. If, if they can keep the mortar teams safe, I don't think Lucifer should engage here. Just wait for the mortar teams. All oh, the flying machines are here to kill the uh, these guys. How do you call them? Griffin Riders. Here come the mortar teams. They trickle in. And uh, the tanks are trying to kill the flying machines. That's a pretty good job there by the Griffins, but the Griffins took a lot of damage. The mortar teams killing everything, of course. Are the mortar teams uh, gonna win the game, or is uh, Blade Master going to die? The oh, we have two Fire Lords for for Team Chamico, Lucifer. Okay, T TP out for Team Hog because they're being attacked, of course, by some raiders. The raiders dying. Yeah, so uh, so Chamico got the Fire Lord first, and Lucifer got the Fire Lord second, and a definite third. This Death Knight didn't even pick Unholy Aura. What the fuck? Hawk, Cash, I mean, Cash, what? Death Pack, you, he cannot even Death Pack. Oh no, he picks it now, never mind. I guess he just leveled up. Uh, there's a Blood Mage for uh, Cash as well. I mean, Blood Mage is, of course, super strong. Here we have an expansion here for Lucifer. I feel like Team uh, Chamiko and Lucifer has, hasn't been expanding fast enough. Everyone else is just getting every gold mine, every expansion they can get. But uh, Team Chamiko and Lucifer are they're just, you know, chilling on the one base, you know. One base for Lucifer. Chamiko at two base, and now Lucifer finally decides to get another base. This base. Never got an expansion built on it. This base is available for quite some time now. Here come the knights. Oh, three upgraded knights, by the way. Of Loliot. This expansion is cancelled. Oh, look at this. The Mortar team is making a new route to this expansion. Warmill, GG Warmill. These uh, these guys have 2-0 upgrades. One tower down. Two towers down. Tunnel is going down. Can I defend? They're walking around. We have Bloodlust on top of the Master Witch Doctors. Do they have any mana? Like mass mana. Like he's an orc, so he doesn't have statues. There's no brilliance aura unless he got an item, but it doesn't look like he did. His ally is his ally has no arc mage. So no mana for these casters. So they run out of uh, mana pretty soon. The mortar teams are so strong against his army. Where's his ally? The death knight are already dead. He is, Cash shouldn't be fighting here. He should not be fighting here. Why is he fighting? Is there a flank attack? Oh, there's a flank attack f by Hawk, but that's not gonna do anything. We have uh, flying machines. Or are they gonna defend? Are the flying machines? Uh, they're running away. They're afraid of the tanks, but the tanks are coming in late. I feel like the flying machines maybe uh, could have fought there for a little bit. But uh, yeah, that was a pretty poor engagement by Team Cash. Hawk just. Joining the fight too late, and also especially the tanks were super late. Cash is just healing up. I feel like he lost a lot, but I'm not sure. He's down to 62 supply. Meanwhile, we have tanks here. The Hawks. Oh, we have the cannon tower defending the ultimate defense against tanks. Cannon tower kills the tanks so fast with the siege damage. This is how you defend against tanks, Knight of players and undead players. Remember. Actually, the tanks might still get the... Nah, they won't get the town hall. After one more tank dies, the DPS... Uh, I mean, the DPS of two tanks won't be enough. This Death Knight, he did pick Unholy Aura level uh, 1. Koya level 2 makes sense because he has a lot of undead units to heal. Team Soin, I'm not sure what uh, they're doing. They're just, you know, creeping around, walking around. Well, Team Yellow and Light Blue are just fighting all over the place. Okay, well, the, the, these guys get the web. Some bad riders on the flying machines. Of 
course, uh, this bad rider gets wept. Naga died. Some other teams, are they gonna kill everything or are they going to uh, kill the blood mage? Okay, they killed the blood mage. We have a healing ward here for cash. Uh, blood mage is totally dead. Of course, the, the warden TP's out. Death knight shows up. Oh, she TP's to this base somewhere else. So she TP's to the back. Uh, but I don't think team cash. Well, actually, Lucifer lost most of his fiends. And it's just more the teams now. Maybe step TP out team Lucifer. Chamiko TP's out. Also, uh, their base is under attack in a moment. So Chamiko TP's just in time to also defend. Uh, more the teams though against knights. Two, three upgraded knights. Uh, the 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 guy is dead. How do you call this guy? Fire Lord. He's dead. And Lucifer is on his way, I think. Casa. Lucifer doesn't have much. Maybe the Fire Lord. Um, but these towers helping the more the teams, just uh, just fine. Lucifer going for an expansion over here. Are under Whoa. Yeah, blue is taking all the bases. They're taking this base. Oh, not yet. They want this base eventually. This base is also available after they creep it. Oh, they, oh my god, they did get the town hall. Team Chamiko is out of bases. They're just, they just have the main, which is almost uh, expiring. Uh, running out of gold, a player's forces are collapsing. The haunted gold mines are collapsing. We have now a fight here between uh, Team Blue and Team Light Blue. The Raiders and Wyvern against tanks and Griffins. Cash helping out a little bit. The Blade Mass here. This place is going to be cancelled again. And do we see a rebuild it, build of this base? Does he not have the money or what? He has the money. Why is he not rebuilding this base? Does he not realize this base got destroyed? I, I guess he didn't realize. Now he is rebuilding it. In this fight here. TP out here by the... Uh, by Hawk? What? I guess his warden got nuked or something. Oh, no, wait. Am I... Uh, no, that's not Hawk. That was... Uh, Sawin. Okay, Sawin TP'd out. So confusing with all these wardens. Everyone has a warden. Hawk has a warden. Sabine has a warden. The light has a warden. The foggy had no. It's a orc worker had a warden. It's TPN by his ally. Knights. The warden go for the keeper. This Kodo goes down. Oh, that's such a shame that Kodo adds so much damage to their army. And uh, the Griffins are now against the wyvern. Easy, easy fight there. Apparently for the Griffins. Because there are more griffins than the wyvern. And uh, there's a nice stasis trap. So much stun. And the griffin, the wyvern here are, are dying. Meanwhile, we have a blade master killing uh, peasants. But, uh, you know, that's not that important. They're, they're level 6 keeper now. Dakta level 6. Is he going to use the ultimate? He's uh, very... He moves to, uh, forward. Use the ultimate. The knight's now uh, just immortal. Are they going to try to kill Dakta? They're trying to. Dakta takes a lot of damage. Can he be stopped out or something? No, Dakta just dies. Hawks, uh, Naga's level 3 now. The Beastmaster level 5 also died for, uh, for, for, for Hawk. These tanks here, one tank goes down. These two tanks are still alive. They could probably just kill, try to kill the Wyvern because they're pretty low in hit points. There goes the Naga. And, uh, well, Team Cash and uh, Hawk are retreating. Oh, the Death Knight is also going to die. I'm not sure if they have any heroes left. Or, or is the Death Knight going to survive somehow? He, the healing ward uh, is healing him for a lot. He also has the Unholy Aura. He's doing just fine. Meanwhile, this gives some time here for Team Chamiko and Lucifer to uh, re-stabilize. This expansion is up. Or stabilize, I guess. To stabilize. Uh, and they go for an expansion over here. Chamiko is still with the mass mortar teams. His ally Lucifer with an Abomination and some Fiends. We look at the uh, okay. The mains are all out of gold. <coughs> Besides these, of course, this one still has a little bit, little, little bit of gold. This one still has like ten thousand. This one is pretty empty. Yeah. The, so the, so uh, let's look at the expansions. It's two, no three, three, four for Team Blue at the center. If we just look at the center expansions, we have four expansions here for Team uh, Blue. Actually, this one isn't up yet. Three expansions for Team Blue. We have uh, almost two for Team Yellow. 
and two for team light blue and actually this one still has 10k gold as well so blue will get another one blue has two expansions here that have a lot of gold that aren't um, mining yet most other gold mines are gonna expire pretty soon so team blue is doing great the hero levels are do oh we have level six warden okay they're fighting where are the mortar teams oh here they are oh but they are not really protected very well mortar teams aren't great against knights oh but if the knights are attacking a lava spawn oh knights are beautiful there's a blade storm by lucifer it's just defending here with some fiends and uh that's it the fiend and the destroyer some lava spawns as well seems like team yellow like the unit combination maybe not the strongest oh but they do kill the warden the level six moon warden uh, there's another level five warden in there this can be killed as well oh this Kodo beast oh never mind the Kodo beast still alive okay there he goes two mortar teams die as well lucifer is afk lucifer use your blade master and your death knight chimico tp's out lucifer okay he's finally uh, decides to uh do something there's some towers here as well what is team uh, Cash doing in the meantime? They're just, you know, walking around. That's what they do. And uh, what level is TC? We have TC for Serene, by the way. Never mentioned that. He's level 3. And uh, these towers, these Blade Master, this, this uh, Fire Lord, everything here is just too powerful. I think actually the orb is better on the Fire Lord here than the Blade Master, but, you know. Oh, there's Dagda using his super ultimate, but. Uh, yeah, it seems like Team Lucifer and Team Chamico they hauled off Team uh, Team Sawin and Loliath. A player's forces are under attack. Oh, and here's an attack by Team uh, Cash. Let's look at the supplies here real fast. 61 and wait, is this human? That's orc. 61 and 75 for Team uh, D Blue. 63 and 56 for Team Yellow. And 69 and 65 for Team Light Blue. So Team Dark Blue does have a slight supply lead over the other teams, but at the moment, this army is looking super duper powerful. While well, Team uh, Blue, Team Low Light and Sawin, I mean Knights. Knights are strong against Team Yellow, but against Team Light Blue, Knights are not that strong. A lot of magic damage, a lot of uh, Griffins. Piggies, casters, even like the knights aren't uh, gonna do much against this light blue army. They have a few flying machines, they have some wyvern. And look at these towers, so beautiful. One, uh, one cannon tower, but it's mostly the formation is almost a perfect square. He misses one. It's like uh, he misses one two. Oh, there goes the knight. We have two shredders here for one for cash, one for hawk. I guess they have plenty of lumber. And uh, here's some bat riders, but these guys have three armored, so the bat riders they don't do that much damage. But the but they're all they're for the flying machines, of course. But not if they die. They just died. Maybe one used a uh, concoction on a uh, griffin, but no one cares about that. The healing ward here in the back as well for cash. This uh, blood mage steals the mana of the warden. This warden uses a fan of knives. Uh, this warden uh, is still alive. Fire Lord is doing just fine. They come from behind. So uh, Flying Machine is going back into the fight. It doesn't look like Team Dark Blue can win this fight. But they're trying. They're trying to force TP or something. This Naga is solo on hit points. She dies. And... Uh, oh, okay, and Team Blue does back off. I wonder what Team Light Blue is going to do. Are they going to kill this base here of Sawin? There's another fan of knives. Shadow, uh, the Warden Shadow Strikes the Warden. They're both level 6. One is silenced. There's some uh, the justify the end justify the means. Meanwhile, these towers are being attacked by the mass mortar teams, which kill towers so fast. Uh, fortified towers, that is. And these orc towers are fortified. The human towers are not fortified, so they're gonna stand a bit longer. We have this uh, Sawin uh, avatar in the back, being attacked by the spears of vengeance of the avatar of uh, Hawk. Spears of vengeance killing an avatar. What? Not, not something you see very often. Flying machines here for Loliath are quite interesting you all this uh, attack here by team uh, lucifer taking out team blue team blue it was in such a good position 
but now they're falling apart. It would be funny if Team Machamiko is actually going to win <laughs> with the Mass Mortar teams. <laughs> they are 3 0 upgraded. They have two level 5 Fire Lords. Do we see Double Volcano maybe later in the game? Double Volcano might be super powerful just for mass stun in uh, two, 2 versus 2. There's also some creeps left here that you could creep. Look at these creeps. Maybe someone wants to creep. All these towers, they were such a beautiful formation, but that just means the mortar teams do more splash damage. Everything here uh, in, in tethers. Oh, this poor, poor little Lyot. He was making such a beautiful tower uh, base. And Team Lolite, they're down to just two gold mines now. Just like uh, the other teams. Look, just like Team Chimico, just like Team Cash. Actually, they're building this. They have three bases now. Team Cash has three bases now. They're ahead over the other two teams by one base. And their army also looks like very powerful. But it looks powerful against blue, but not against yellow. The mortar teams will crush this army so easily. And how many Griffins do we have? The Griffins get wrapped. Oh, there's only two fiends though. Lucifer, Lucifer doesn't have that much. How much supply does he have? 69. He has some destroyers, I guess. I'm not sure. I think Team Light Blue might be able to take on even Team Yellow. Six Griffins, seven, seven Griffins. Depends on the, how they position themselves. If the Griffins get to the Mortar Teams, of course, the Mortar Teams die so fast. And earlier there were plenty of fiends to wipe the griffins, but this at this point there are only three fiends. The destroyers are nice uh, against the casters, but oh, look at this dragon hog just trying to snipe them more. <laughs> Chimiko man, he doesn't realize there are other units that humans can build, of course. This is uh, how he plays this game. Thunderhawk, find some acolytes. There's towers everywhere, but not here. Oh, the dragon hogs eat the eat the birdie. Goes down. We have a level 6 blade master. Here we have level 6 beast master. Do we see stomp stampede during a fight? Maybe. Dark ranger here is level 5. Okay, they're gonna creep a bit. Do the markets all have the same items? Or do they have different items? I guess they have different items. That would make sense, right? I don't remember what the other one had, but... The four marketplaces on this map. Okay, Team Lucifer going for these two more uh, two more expansions. They will have four expansions. If they get it up, they'll, they'd be ahead in expansions over everyone else. Actually, Team... Uh, team Loliath already ran out of one expansion. They're down to one one gold mine. 5k. 200. Okay, this one's gonna run out of gold as well. So team cash will be at two gold mines. And team uh, Lucifer will be at four gold mines for a while. All these expansions still have plenty of gold. Even this one. 6k. There goes the gold mine. Are under so, uh, yeah, two gold mines only. These tanks are beautiful. Let's look at the supplies. Uh, 75, 78. 78, 79. So both these, uh, all these players have 80 supply. Here as well, Loliath and where's the win? Are under so win only 22 supply. So team uh, blue. Actually, does so win have anything? He has some buildings over here. Shop over there. He has a spirit lodge over there. Yeah, so win has 22 supply. His ally has 80 supply. So team uh, blue just has to wait for these other two teams to fight. Because they're pretty much, uh, they almost have only half the supply of the other teams. The other teams are at around 160 and they only have like 100 and, uh, 102. Oh, there's a stampede, but I... <laughs> Is it even, you know, worth the mana to stampede this? 
There's a soul burn. They came from behind. And Team Light Blue shouldn't even be a bothering here with Team Blue here, or should they? Team Blue is just like this, this sneaky team that's just waiting for their opportunity to strike. Paladin, by the way, for the light. I never <laughs> realized they had a Paladin. But uh, yeah, they're just waiting for the opportunity. Do you first kill this team? Actually, maybe you first kill this team, get more XP, get stronger heroes. And uh, use that to kill Team Yellow. But Team Yellow has four XP, uh, expansions now. Well, Team Cash only has two. So they're giving more time for Team Yellow to uh, mine by killing uh, Team Blue first. And Team Yellow takes their opportunity. They don't want to give uh, the, all this free XP here to Team Light Blue. So they're going for the flank attack. They're going for the, uh, you know, sandwich. Team Light Blue sandwich. Maybe. There's a peon over there. Actually, do they know? I'm not sure. They, they have... Uh, they just use... They have these mortar teams. They have mass mortar teams. And these guys, every single one of them has the flare. So they should know everything that's happening on this map. With those flares, right? They can... They have like... Uh, what? 6, 10, 15, 18. 18 mortar teams or so. They can just continuously flare everything. There you see a flare. Force. Okay, well, we see some more creeping. Beautiful creeping here. This Murloc here, uh, Tide Warrior. This Murloc here is a cliffhanger. This, this Sea Turtle. Oh, they're all dead. Level 4 TC. Nice play here by the TC. Creeping some more. There's some creeps over here as well. Maybe you can get a level 5 TC and a level 5 Paladin. Or one of the two. Or neither. Also, the Fire Lord is level 4. Beautiful tower positioning here by uh, Chamiko. A player's forces are under That's uh, support units for the mortar teams, towers. Yeah, I mean, this base is totally up and defended by towers. This base is, you know, up and defended by towers, including the cannon towers. Cannon towers are just so great against the tanks. A and a pause here by Hawk. Are they... <laughs> oh, 30 seconds. For a second, I thought... <laughs> the toilet. I, I thought he was going to be like, uh, hey, you guys want to, you know draw or something or team up two teams against one i don't think i'm not sure if it's allowed it might not be allowed to uh two versus one mexican standoff sneaky koreans gamma actually i should change the gamma of the of my room Now I can see again. Oh, so beautiful. Us usually with Hawk, it's cat. <laughs> Chaco check Hawk cashes bank. Okay, well, I will. Um, the light has uh, 4.5 gold, uh, K gold, by the way. Let's check all the banks. Sure, let's check the bank of every player in this game. So, so Wien has uh, 200 gold. Loliath has uh, 8,000 lumber and 4.5k and gold. Oh, I just said that, didn't I? Yeah. Okay, what about Team Yellow? Chamiko, 2k gold. Lucifer, 1.3k gold. Team Light Blue, Mass Torrens. Uh, 1k gold for cash. And 300 gold for, Lol uh, for, uh, for Hawk. So Lolite does have the most gold and he's not even mining. Did he go over 80? He went over 80. But as a team, as a team... A forces are well, I'm not sure. Lolite just spent a lot of gold machine. because he went over 80. He's probably building a lot of units. Mass flying machines. Wait, what? Is that all? Hello, peon. Piggy Scout goes down. Mortar teams now. Light at 97 supply. Yeah, 
There's a thing. How do you call the thing? Flare. More towers. Chamiko building the mass towers though. That's so powerful, of course. The more towers you have, the more uh, bigger chance that you win the game. But the Tauren. The Tauren. Guess, you know, they're gonna stand off for the rest of the game. Like, what's gonna happen? No one wants to attack, you know, light blue and yellow. They want, don't want to attack each other. Because if one attacks, you know, guess who's gonna sneak in and kill everyth everything, uh... Everything. It's gonna be Loliot, right? If one of these players tries to take out Loliot, the other team is gonna attack you. And then, you know, it's just a three-way tie, guys. A three-way standoff or Mexican standoff. Is that, is that what it means? Oh, this peasant here is dead. Three-way, uh... She's just gonna wait here. Just gonna... Oh, kill. Uh, Piggy. Piggy. Tactic tactically... Stands next to the tower, so he kills the tower by dying himself. Mikasa's level 6. Oh, Mikasa. Mikasa doesn't even have an orb. He gave the orb to the Volcanus. Smart choice. He has an orb here on the Death Knight. The Orb of Fire. Such a powerful orb. It's actually probably better than the Orb of Corruption on the Death Knight in this situation. Where you just want him to uh, attack air and the splash damage does just so much damage. But I don't, I'm not sure if it is. <laughs> Orb of Corruption is so powerful. It is 100 gold, more gold. One tower went down. What orbs do we have here? No orbs whatsoever. Guess they don't have any good orbs. They don't have the Orb of Fire. Even though they play human. Okay, do we see this fight here? Look at this fight. This avatar goes down so fast. More teams to take a bit of damage, but they're still alive mostly. Did he use the heal scroll or something? These uh, these blade blade match using a, a blade storm here in the front. The griffins, I mean, some of them get wept. The, oh, there's stampede even. Stampede. The mortar teams. If the mortar teams go down, Team Chamiko is in trouble. The mortar teams are now under attack. They're retreating. There are more towers here. They just go from one line of towers to the next line. But there's only like six mortar teams, and the, and the uh, these guys Torin are so strong. Uh, Griffins as well. You could kill these towers easy peasy. There goes an uh, something a shredder. Shredder went down. The warden should be careful. Is he buying something there? A uh, beast master went down. Blade master now level seven. Mikasa. They came from behind. He gave the orb back to Mikasa. I think he was uh, planning to buy another orb there. He gave one orb of crypts to Mikasa, uh, to the Volcanus, and was planning to buy one on the Blade Master. But then he was just, uh, just there. He was attacked, so he gave the uh, orb back to the Blade Master. Blue, oh, blue is uh, flanking behind. I didn't even notice. <laughs> blue, attacking uh, light blue. I have to pay attention to so many stuff here in these FFAs, the mini map. What's happening? The ping problems, ping issues. Eliot has some lag. Go, 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 go. Okay. Uh, but I mean, Blue's army kind of sucks against this army. <laughs> Uh, the mortar teams are of course great again. Uh, they came from behind. The death knight here takes a lot of damage. And uh, oh, look at this Dagda using his uh, healing. These, uh, these these guys going for the fire lord. The fire lord takes a lot of damage. But he's mic'd back beautifully. Paladin is here. What's team yellow doing? They're just licking their wounds. Uh, Lolai does TP out. Oh no, this hawk. Hawk TP's out. And um, our team Lolai also TP's out. So we is uh, so he has three heroes. He cannot lose a single hero because if he loses one, he cannot re re uh, remake him. I think. Yeah, he doesn't have a single burrow or town hall. 
So keeping all heroes alive is amazing. He has an info potion, info potion, and no info potion. He probably could use another info potion. What's the fire lord doing here? You should be careful. Uh, this guy's trying to hunt down some uh, some statues. What's Chamiko doing? Is he building more mortar teams? No. He said 55 supply. He doesn't have lumber. 28 lumber here for uh, Chamiko. 3k gold. His ally as well. 3k gold, 80 lumber. Team Lucifer and Chamiko. Maybe they should have uh, gotten some more shredders. Actually, <laughs> Lucifer cut all these trees, but still doesn't have any lumber to have. Uh, they lost their shredders in the last fight, but they need another one. Just cut more trees. He will. The, the Lyot here going for the attack on Hawk. Hawk has no more gold, but a lot of lumber. And uh, Cash has also no gold, but a lot of lumber. Maybe they can trade some uh, money with Team Yellow. <laughs> there is the healing. Healing! This expansion went down. Team Cash is out of expansions, by the way. And out of gold. And Team Blue. That's the one expansion still. Is mining again because Low Light went uh, back under 70 supply. Low Light still has a uh, 3.5k gold bank. Looking good for Team Yellow. Even though they just lost that fight here. It's still looking good. Mostly because Team Blue just uh, attacked at the right moment here. <laughs> attacking Team Light Blue. So Team Light Blue had to TP out. And they, they don't have enough to uh, go for another attack. Team Yellow is just mining gold. They don't have lumber. But they do have plenty of gold. So much gold. This expansion is uh, out of gold. So it's like one, two, three mining bases for uh, Team Yellow. One mining base for Team Blue. Light Blue. One long distance mining base. But it's not even... Uh, doesn't even have that much gold left in it. But they have Tauren. Griffins. Tanks. Gold's chopping the trees over here. <laughs> okay, send them somewhere else. Somewhere uh, maybe over here. And they do have a shredder. I, there it is. There's a shredder. Oh, and there's the creeping. The paladin might get level 5 here. Not yet. Wand of Illusion. He's almost level 5. Maybe if he creeps this creep camp, it should be enough. Okay, well, here comes the attack of Lolliot on team, uh, team Chamiko. More teams. Look at this. There's a skink. Uh, Hunter Goldmine does go down. Does Team Yellow, can they defend against this? They can, they have a lot of more teams themselves. Lolliot is falling asleep here. But uh, better wake up. Maybe you should drink some coffee. You can play with one hand at this point. Ah, oh, the gold mine being rebuilt. GGG is Korean laugh? Oh, <laughs> I thought he was sleeping. Oh, maybe in Korea. Like when we're laughing in uh, the rest of the world, they're sleeping over there. I, yeah, sure. Here come the destroyers. Uh, just the destroyers might be able to kill everything. If they kill the flying machines, the tanks and the mortar teams uh, don't stand a chance. There is a nice, uh, how do you call this? Uh, blade storm. Yeah, they could eat uh, the lava spawn. Nice stomp there. <laughs> blade mass used the info potion. And... Uh, they came from behind the TP out here by Lucifer. They came from behind and uh, there goes some more flying machines. Involved Team Light Blue over here. There's healing. Tokta is healing. The Light, how much does he have? He has uh, 70 supply. He has plenty of money to go back to 80. Team Yellow at 100 supply. Team Light Blue is just sitting over here. They have a level 6 Dark Ranger now, by the way. Do we see some uh, charm charm play? It's very good in this situation where you don't have any income. But uh, 
And he does have a staff. He could just char star a charm unit, staff at home, charm it, staff at home. Maybe try to get back into the game that way. Get some tanks, some free tanks. No, you cannot charm tanks, can you? No, can't get some free mortar teams. Maybe charm the Fire Lord. I feel like if the Dark Ranger is so much higher level than the Fire Lord, she should be able to charm the Fire Lord. Of course, not in, in this case level 6 versus level 6, but like if you have a level 8 uh, Dark Ranger like against a level 2 Fire Lord, you should be able to fire, uh, to charm him. Maybe in uh, Worker 3 Remastered, there's a nice uh, reveal. There's another one. Forgot about their gold. Um, how can I? How do I keep forgetting those? Sparks. You can. Uh, you can. You cannot steal mechanical units because they're uh, mechanical, right? You cannot charm a mechanical unit. Only, only human or only living beings. Get charmed by the beauty of the Dark Ranger. Mechanical units can see your beauty. There's a, ma a manual of health. Paladin level 5. Uh, we do have this orb, by the way, on the TC. Such a super powerful item. Also, the orb here on the uh, Warden. Orb of Fires is what I'm talking about, guys. Not uh, a shitty orb like Orb of Corruption, Orb of Venom. But you can steal tanks, 100%. You sure? I'm pretty sure you can't, right? But you can't steal tanks, 100%. Yeah, everyone else in my chat is also uh, pretty sure that you cannot steal tanks. You should always be able to charm Lapis because he always go for the highest bidder. <laughs> is that how it works? Well, we'll see. We'll see if uh, what this Dark Ranger is gonna charm. They're finally going to hunt uh, some units to charm. I'm not sure what the warden is doing here. She maybe wants to hunt down some human units to kill. The blade master cannot be charmed. He's uh, maybe the warden is just there to defend the, the dark ranger. There's silence on the blade master. A player's forces are under attack. Yeah, I'm also pretty sure you cannot charm tanks because I remember seeing uh, games with the Dark Ranger and the opponent just only making mechanical units just to counter the charm. So I'm 100% I'm sure you cannot charm tanks. 100% guys. Of course you guys were already 100% but I have to think about it a little bit because you know it's not like we see that very often level 6 Dark Ranger. Not sure where she is right now. Is she here? There she is. It's called mine. It's actually gonna be mine. By the peons, long distance. Oh, blade master Mikasa. Maybe we'll get some peon kills. Mikasa. 100 damage, uh, 252. The first one is uh, 100 extra damage. The second one is 252 total damage. This uh, this peasant here just takes so much damage. Blade Master takes the coil damage because of the flying machine. He's seen. Oh, he got purged actually. That was not uh, an orb of purge. That was actually a shaman casting purge. Something you've never seen in your life probably to see a purge uh, being used on a unit other than a summon. I will manual cast. On the Blade Master, that was quite interesting. Uh, Blade Master does retreat. Meanwhile, um, this gold mine is almost mined out. This gold mine is uh, same amount of gold. Team Yellow is just you know they're not even mining anymore because they went over 80, I guess. Let's look at their supplies. Chamiko is at the 100 supply. Lucifer is at 93 supply. It's looking like a pretty easy game for Team Chimiko and Lucifer. <laughs> you can also charm the skink, by the way. Uh, unfortunately, I think if you charm a skink, it does get attacked. Unlike the critters from the human shop. 
Well, I'm actually I'm not hundred percent sure about that. Can you sum up very short what this cup is about and how long it is and how long it is for the viewers that just came? It's just uh, one map. This cup is just one map. We had one map last week. Last week it was a uh, free for all, just teams of one player each. Uh, today we have uh, four teams of two players. Team oh, Foggy and Orc Workers are already out. Yeah. Now we're left with these three teams in this uh, beautiful standoff formation. It's just one game though, so uh, if this game goes on for another two or three hours, that's fine because we have nothing else on the planning. So, uh, sure. Tamika and Lucifer need to switch back to a better army at some point. Mass Mortar is good for cam camping, but they cannot win an open fight like this. Well. The mortar teams are very nice at killing buildings though. And they can just build more towers maybe. I mean Chamiko just he just likes the mortar teams. He has some tanks. <laughs> this tank wall is beautiful, by the way. <laughs> Look at this, the Great Wall of Korea. Tanks and towers. No one will pass through. Well, actually peasants can pass through. But no one else passes through. What's the longest game you ever casted? Uh, I don't know, maybe an hour long game. There was a, a pretty long game last week in Vitality's Cup, which was like 15 minutes or so. If you watch FFA often, this is just a standard standoff. This can go on for a lot of time. No gold up. No gold saved up for Jamiko. No. He has 25 gold, but he's not mining. He's not mining. There's 3k left in that gold mine. And Lucifer has about uh, 15, uh, 13k gold Players in the gold mines. Foggy saying regain. Wait, how can Foggy be an observer? Wait, after you lose, you become an observer? Is that how it works? There goes the piggy. Look, he's an observer. I didn't know that it worked like that. That's amazing. The tech in this uh, in this game, in this 10 year old, 15 year old game, is uh, is amazing. Probably no games that are made nowadays. You become an observer after you lose. Uh, you just get kicked out of the game. Look, look at Hawk <laughs> using diplomacy. We need team versus Lucy. They have 6k, two times gold mine. Okay, go, go. <laughs> okay. Team Lucy and pro uh, kill Lucy K. <laughs> Sounds like a trap. Oh. A player's forces diplomacy. Are two versus one. Hello, Michael Show. Welcome back. Well, um, Team Light Blue is slowly walking. Team uh, Light is waiting over there. Here comes a piggy. I mean, Cash doesn't doesn't want to commit. Hawk wants to go, but Cash doesn't. He thinks it's a trap still. Look, he's retreating. Oh no, he's pulling pe uh, peons. The light is waiting. Oh, there's a mortar team stolen. Go, go, is what the light is saying. Nice that the light saw, that the saw this somehow. Players' forces are under attack. Piggy uh, trying to kill tanks. Cash is still uh, FK here in the back. Okay. Light retreats because uh, Team Lucy is going for Lolliet. Oh, they come to my base. <laughs> They're coming to Lolliet's base. There goes one more to team. You will hawk here in the center. Playing with Chimiko. 
Can you check the resources real quick? Uh, no resources for anyone. A player's forces are under well, attack. the light sells 3k in the gold. Lu uh, Chamiko has 9 gold. Lucifer. Oh, Lucifer is mining again. He's 2k in gold. He's over uh, AD, but he's still mining. Oh, the warden over there gets staffed out. No gold for team uh, Cash. Look, 158 for uh, Hawk. Cash has uh, 112 gold. Serene has no gold. Only uh, Lolite and, and Lucifer have some gold. Chamiko still not mining. Lolite here sniping some towers. A player's forces are under attack. Blade Master shows up. Well. Let's see how many more units can she steal. Staff stone cooldown, but uh, and the tank line makes it so hard to charm because you have to, you know, get past this uh, this tank line somehow. Meanwhile, Lucifer fighting against Lolliot, Chamiko against Hawk, and Cash is just I think he's making dinner or something. Okay, moves uh, a little bit. He has a level six Beastmaster. Summons a piggy. He just summons piggies and birdies. Oh, Lucifer going for a uh, little light again. Or at least, you know, making sure little light doesn't kill any of his buildings. With those mortar teams. Flying machines are 3 3 upgraded. I think everything at this point is 3 3. No, actually, that's not true. The tanks are only 3 2. He's uh, this piggy and the hawk. Oh, they almost got a mortar team, but they get staffed out. There go all the birdies, all the piggies. They're all gone. Warden staffed out. Okay, well, uh, there's a warden. She's killing some peasants. So use the avatar. There's two peasants. Do we see some more uh, spirits? Maybe she could use some spirits. The tanks here. The tanks are moving. The tanks are moving. Dark Ranger is waiting for an opportune moment to steal some uh, steal some units. She can't steal tanks, but she can steal mortar teams. And Chamiko. Oh, what is this? The light is uh, is he winning this fight against Team Chamiko and Lucifer? One against two. This uh, this Fire Lord. Oh, Team is out, but Team is out to close by, and uh, some of the mortar teams did go down. But there's a TP out. Lucifer lost so much. Lucifer lost so much in the fight against uh, Loliath. Lucifer is down to 78 supply. Okay, I guess he didn't lose that much, but he is. Uh, he lost a little bit. Chamiko 83 supply, still mining, he's waiting, this is uh, their backup uh, gold mine. Birdie, the birdie goes down, Poof. oh and he levels up from that. The warden now level 6, so they have a level 6 and a level 6 warden. The difference is this warden has a orb of fire, this one doesn't. The fire lord is very close to level 5. Here, hawk with the warden. The mortar teams here. Going for the haunted gold mine. Oh, the destroyers. But they're flying machines here. Better be careful, destroyers. Flying machines, of course, have a range of 500. Tanks have a range of uh, 500 as well. You know, well, Stampede. Hitting a few towers. Don't think these uh, these hit these. Only if they hit over here. Like this, these uh, guys don't even hit those towers. But he kills some of the towers. And, uh, there's the Dark Ranger. She, she wants to kill, uh, steal more units. A player's forces are under attack. <laughs> Light as just the uh, ultimate super army. 
And then uh, it's level 5. He just uses Divine Shield. It's level 2 Divine Shield. Uh, there goes uh, the Fiend. The tanks and destroyers are just uh, so powerful. Blade Master going for something. But there's an Info Potion used here on Fire Lord. Is this a fight? This looks like a fight to me. But so many tanks. The flying machines are never going to win this against this many tanks. But maybe they can kill the destroyers before they die. There's a healing thing. Does that work on mechanical units? Uh, I think it does. Look at him. Oh, but he gets soul burned. And uh, Team Lolite better retreat now. Volcanus died there for Lucifer. Or his ally, maybe Jamiko. No, it was Lucifer. The light says go, go. Team uh, Light Blue here going for the flank attack. Or flank attack. The cutting off the retreat here. There's a fan of knives. There's an avatar. All these uh, mortar teams take so much damage. There, the, the Death Knight is, is uh, TPing out here for Lucifer. And um, all these tanks are going are dying here. These tanks are dying. And all oh, these towers now dying. Team Cash and the uh, Hawk just crushing this base here. It's such a crushing uh, defeat for the towers. They only have one masonry upgrade. What is this? Chimiko. Wow. There's proof that Chimiko is not Infi. Only masonry level one. This uh, these towers are also going down very fast. These griffins are. Uh, can I select a griffin? Inner fired, unholy aura, bloodlusted. Eleven armor, forty percent. They do a lot of damage. They, oh, look at this base. It's only it still has two k gold left. Here come the tanks though. Thanks for Jamiko. Can I defend here? I don't think they can defend. <laughs> they are gonna run these uh, these towers here. Maybe they can protect this base. More the teams. It's uh, the mining over here. And you will low light. It's gonna kill this base. And how much did he mine over here? 2k gold left. And uh, wow. Chamiko ah. with the tanks. That's all he has. Tanks and a few mortars. All oh, the mortars are dead there. Guess uh, there was no arcane tower. Not just not, uh, even if there was one arcane tower, it wouldn't be enough. You need like five or six or seven or twelve. These uh, tanks here defending against the griffins that do so much damage. Here come the destroyers of Lucifer. Lucifer's 80 supply. Chamiko at 40 supply only. Hawk at uh, 83 and Cash at 60. So it looks like Team uh, Cash is so much stronger there than Team Chamiko. This, uh, this Fire Lord Michael back. Flying machines uh, take a bit of damage. They take so much damage now, running over the tanks. The destroyers are doing just fine. The Death Knight here in the back, level 5. He has the Orb of Fire still, so he's so so strong. Here's the tanks. The tanks shooting all the air units. The destroyers take a bit of damage. The, the other units as well. Someone TP'd or something, because we have a, a flank attack here by Team Loliat on Team, uh, team Cash. The Warden has fallen for... Uh, for for who was it? For foggy, uh, not foggy. For uh, hawk. And now we see this uh, cleanup here by Loliath. They realize if Team Cash. Oh, what? Someone something got stolen. The Ranger died though, but she saw a unit just before she died. This is uh, timing for Loliath. He needs to cripple all the other teams. Now that he has the superior army, he kills the uh, border teams. Loliath is amazing. Is he just gonna win this game by himself? His wardens here for Serene and Loliath, of course, super powerful. Two avatars, just uh, so powerful. Just the ultimate here of the keeper, just so powerful. This base is going down. No more bases. And Loliath is building a base. Loliath, how much gold does he have? How much supply does he have? 86 supply for Loliath. And 1k gold. Well, here, Chimiko at 31 and Lucifer at 72. So together, they still have more supply than Loliath. And here we have uh, 55 and 16 only. Hawk lost so much. Are you kidding me? I didn't realize he lost so much. So now actually Team Cash and Hawk are crippled the most. They have less supply together than uh, Loliath. Does Serene still have uh, units left? 16? Yeah, he still has all three of his heroes left, of course. And one peon somewhere. It looks uh, looking really good for Team uh, Loliath. Did we have a lot of gold saved up? 1k for Chamiko. Lucifer is uh, 200 gold, 72 supply right now. <laughs> Hawk, no TP. Well, okay. He is getting his warden back. Maybe the warden had a TP and she died? Or did she um, not have a TP? This 
entire map is just dead. No light, you're just sneaking this gold mine as fast as you could. Lucifer uh, rebuilding that gold mine. Peon is going to scout here. The piggy as well. The piggy of cash and the, the peon of uh, Chamiko. The light, low light, and so in just defending that uh, gold mine from the evil peasant. This gold mine has like a few hundred gold left. Okay, well, Lucifer and Jamiko uh, don't allow for uh, for gold mines. This is their gold mine. Can I defend it though? Can I kill it? Let's see, what did I say? 49 and 72. 74 and 49. It's like 123. The light is a hunter supply though. But there's a there's a, a, a thing. How do you call this thing? The blade storm. There's a stomp. Level 3 stomp. The fire lord is so dead. Uh, there's the doctor. Oh, but he gets stunned by the volcano. We have a volcano here by this this uh, other fire lord. And volcano stunning everything. It's so powerful. And now he soul burns the warden. He does retreat. Someone is TPing out. There's Lucifer TPing out. And Chamiko also TPing out. And uh, more teams so powerful against the tanks. And the one tank here remains behind. It is still alive. And the mortar team though. What's the mortar team doing here? Do we see the Dark Ranger? Where's the Dark Ranger? Can she steal the mortar team? No, the Dark Ranger died. I think there was uh, Hawk's Dark Ranger. And he doesn't have the money to rebuild her. So no more Dark Ranger. Unless this uh, this long distance mining. Oh no, the gold mine is gone. A player's forces are under attack. Ninety-seven gold. Okay, here comes uh, Team Cash. They find a little light here. Before then, uh, gets her mana stolen. Uh, the avatar here goes down, and the gold mine is empty. No reason to defend this uh, position anymore. Lucifer is uh, mining here with one acolyte only. How much money does this ally have? Cash? Zero. Zero gold for cash. 97 for Hawk. Well, he has 21 gold now because of the three peons. But uh, yeah, not even close enough to get a Dark Ranger back. He could sell some parry ups. Oh, he did get the Dark Ranger back. Does he have a second altar? Oh, he has. A, okay, never mind. He has a second altar. Great. Um, there goes a acolyte. So Team Cash now still has a chance here with it. Uh, with that Dark Ranger back, Team Cash. They're at uh, 55 plus 26. So they're at uh, how much is that? 70, 81 supply in, in total. The light is at 66, and Sawin is still at 16. Yeah, so they're at 72, 82. So very similar to Team Cash. And Team Lucifer, 47 and 60. 107 supply. That's, they're up in supply, but not by that much. And, oh, this this one got killed again. They don't have income either. And there, look at this Dark Ranger. She's just perfect in this situation. Now there's no super armies anymore. Now she can run around freely without worrying about dying. She can steal destroyers. She can steal anything she wants. And just uh, slowly win the game here. With her charm. The longer this game goes on, on, I think the better it is for Team Cash. Because of this Dark Ranger. And the plot match can just give her as much mana as she needs. So you can steal mana from the Warden. Wait, he gives mana to... No, you cannot steal mana from your other heroes. That's... Uh, doesn't work that way. But he can, you know, get mana. There's no way to get mana, really. Anyway, the Blood Mage mana regeneration and the, the Dark Ranger's mana regeneration should be enough to cast plenty of uh, charms. What is she gonna? She's just searching for units to charm. Let's look at Little Light's army. Yeah, plenty of units here to charm. Griffins, knights, mortar teams. Here are this other army. We have uh, not the tanks, but the mortar teams, the destroyers. This charm girl is just gonna win the game here by herself. Bird 
already scouting over here. Don't summon on this uh, building. This birdie is just a perfect scout here to scout for units to charm. Can, can maybe charm this lava spawn, but that's useless, I guess. Acolyte, is there any reason to charm the Acolyte? Don't think so. It's not like you charm the Acolyte and now you can unsummon your own buildings. That would be funny if that could work that way. If the Acolyte can just unsummon any uh, building. Acolyte here unsummons everything and he's, uh, he's dead. He's just gonna give some XP. Turns into a skeleton. Beyond here. Oh, the long distance mining this mi gold mine now. Mm hmm. The light is waiting. He's probably eating some chicken behind this. Uh, I'm not sure if Lolite is uh, streaming right Oh, he found creeps. I'm not sure if Lolite is streaming right now, but he's probably, uh, regardless, he's probably just eating chicken. Oh, there's a reveal. Flare used here by probably Chamiko, maybe Lolayet. He also has these guys, they can uh, cast Flare. The Mortar teams are 3 and 0 here by, for Chamiko, by the way. And there are 3 three for Lolayet. He actually the, uh, thought the upgrade, the defense upgrade was useful. Well, uh, Chamiko didn't think it was. Dang it. How many games are there? There's just the only there's only one game. It's like Go Chicken or something. I forgot. I forgot what the meme was, but uh Dark Ranger likes chicken. A player's forces are under attack. I mean Lolite like <laughs> not the Dark Ranger, Lolite likes chicken. The Thorn are run, only have two attack upgrades. But Mage is doing fine. Uh Come on, can't you? He could have charmed the creeps there, by the way. Instead of killing the creeps, since I didn't give XP anyway, he could have charmed them. Maybe he thought, you know, they were they're not strong enough to. Well, is there any reason to not charm the creeps there? He's at 29 supply. Just there's, there's no reason to just not charm them. Maybe he doesn't want to give XP away, but it's not like they're that weak. These uh, these creeps. The murloc there was pretty strong. Maybe he thought he was gonna use a charm pretty soon, so he didn't want to use the cooldown and the mana on that uh, on those creeps. Shredder, why is the shredder over there? He should probably be with the rest of the army. I mean, he cannot be charmed, but you know, you'd think the goblin on top could be charmed. Oh, he, he charms. The birdie? No, wait, that was his own birdie. What did he charm? Did he charm something? Stuff it out? Yes, he did. But uh, the Granger lost her life for it, so that wasn't worth it. The Warden might also lose her. No, she, she, she blinks out. The tanks here fighting. Lucifer pauses the game. He needs to get <laughs> the bathroom. He doesn't realize <laughs> that the other two players are fighting, of course. So he's just like, uh, he thinks everyone's just sitting in the base waiting. <laughs> so Lucifer uses the bathroom. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wonder what she charmed though. I still want to check the base there. Maybe I should pause the game and be like, hey, I need to use the bathroom. Still see a lot of griffins here. Maybe he didn't charm a griffin. Okay, everyone's saying G. 
Uh, let's just quickly see what he... Okay, he, he charmed the knight. It costed her life, but, you know, sometimes, you know, if it's the knight she loves, it's maybe worth her life. Uh, there's a... <laughs> on the tower, one tank went down. Can Team Cash not fight this? I mean, they don't want to fight this. A mass uh, griffins. I mean, it's just too strong. They don't have anything to fight the mass griffins. The blood mage, so losing the blood mage. Oh, there's a coil on the warden. There's a fork lining on the warden. The blood mage, the blood mage. Is he going to die? He's, he's dead. The warden blinks out a bit too late to dodge that coil. I wonder if that was, you know, can be attributed to uh, ping. But I'm not sure. There's an entangle on this death knight. And this death knight here is also dead. And Cash just loses everything. Team Cash, if I only, you know, did a little bit better. But uh, the Beastmaster is. Uh, the Beastmaster goes down. Do they have any heroes left? Yeah, one warden. Yeah, one warden. <laughs> bye. Light is saying bye. Oh, is it because they're retreating? <laughs> what is Team Lucifer doing in the meantime? Just sitting here. Just using the bathroom, you know. Do we have, uh, what do we have? We have, oh, we have a Naga still as well. Naga still alive. No money to rebuild any heroes. We don't want to fight, I want to sleep. <laughs> you can leave the game and go to sleep, is uh, what Cash is saying here. I mean, you don't even need to leave the game, he could just sleep anyway, right? You will wake up when uh, someone attacks you. <laughs> I want to turn on Warcraft, he's gonna play all night. Guess he's gonna sleep for 10 minutes. We have a little hermit crab over there. Griffins, you know. <laughs> okay, okay, well. Things are going great. This game is going great. Finally, some FMA talk. <laughs> Is it normal? Normal FFA talk? So, Win is apparently Russian. Great, um, great. Can I chat with the players as well? No, I'm an observer, guys, not a referee. Team Samiko just, uh, can I show you see the APM? I'm sure some people have about, you know, very close to zero APM at this point. Team Cash is just mining this gold mine. Then they can mine this gold mine. They actually will get enough gold to get the heroes back. If everyone else is just AFK, Look, the Dark Ranger already back. If everyone just sitting in their base doing nothing, these long distance uh, gold mining peons will mine this one out. 1500 gold. Uh, I don't think cash is over 50 supply, right? No, 40 supply, so they get full gold. And then this gold mine as well. It's gonna take some time, but uh, they get the heroes back and they might, uh, yeah, they might still be in this game, guys. Any prize money, like forty dollars? Okay. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm oh, what's this? Uh, blade man. Oh, blade man is gonna hunt some peons. Lucifer realizes, hey, maybe cash is just long distance mining uh, all these gold mines, or, or maybe instead. Oh, actually, Lolita was long distance mining here, pretending to be AFK. I mean, he's AFK. But Serene maybe was uh, actually maybe Serene is doing this. Blade Master gets two kills and he's level eight. 
Nice job. Now he has a uh, mirror image. Mirror image on this blade master is pretty strong. There's no peons here because the peons are safe over here. What a lucky peons. Is a blade master. He could maybe just patrol the blade master and continue uh, watching, you know, K-pop uh, videos or whatever Lucifer is doing. But um, oh, he did he just give an item to the fire lord? Info potion. Is he going to buy a new one? They do have the money for an info potion. Oh, he finds some peons. 100 damage, kills one. This peon here is also dead. Oh, but he's gonna defend the peon line. It's just one blade master. The blade master does retreat. This match will play one more day. It is playing beyond <laughs> beyond a year. Go Korea. First Korea, we fight first winner. Our team is South Korea. Wait, they weren't talking about North Korea. Our team is South Korea, they're North Korea. We are enemy. Is he saying that Team Lucifer and Jamiko is North Korea? Lolite is back, by the way. Guess we waited for 10 minutes. How about Korea versus Europe? We from Russia. Hey, this uh, this Blade Master in a bit of trouble. He has the info potion and he gets away easy peasy. Korea versus Russia. You already killed Europe. <laughs> uh, Orc worker and Foggy. I guess there's two Bobs. Bobs? What? Hermit crap. Oh, did Lolai just do that? Or was that... Um, yeah, it must have been Lolai, right? I mean, Team Cash, they have a Sentry Ward there. A player's forces are under attack. <laughs> Eating all the Sentry Wards here with the Destroyers for some mana. <laughs> nice play here by Team Lucifer. Oh, Team Lucifer probably used to reveal there. The, um, the flare. Okay, okay, this is a beautiful, beautiful game here. The tanks here, the mortar teams, you know, uh, not mortar teams. Tauron, almost same thing. Just killing stuff here. This tower tries to defend, but you know, he cannot hold off like this entire army by himself. And Cash is just, oh. Guys, look. Look at the gold of Cash, 96. 98, 90, 100, 103, 105, 106, 108, 110. You guys know what this is, right? Pillage. One radio with pillage. Can you t check players' gold? Only Lolayet has. Uh, no, no one has gold left. Uh, like we have uh, 63 gold here for Jamiko. We have Lucifer. How much gold does Lucifer have? Zero for Lucifer. I mean, we know Team Light Blue has no gold. That's why they're uh, using Pillage now to get any amount of gold. And, and Team Loliath at 30 gold. No gold for anyone, really. Oh! The raider here, the raider in danger. Oh, the raider with pillage died. Oh, the coil and the blade master. Such a nice combination to kill a raider. And, uh, well, he's using the peons to, uh, to long distance mine this gold mine. So that's why the peons are not using the pillage. 
But yeah, he only has pe uh, peons left that have pillage. He does have a Dark Ranger again. He could steal units again. But he has to be careful and not lose his Dark Ranger like he did last time. Maybe an Info Potion would be nice. How about regame? 2 versus 2 versus 2. A player's forces are under attack. Blade man <laughs> killing peons. <laughs> Lucy cheats with blade master. A town is under siege. Um, time regain, please. I mean, I don't have uh, I don't have power to say anything. I'm just a uh, caster, you know. I think if all the players agree, maybe uh, 100 kg was the admin, might agree. Or maybe, even if they don't agree, maybe 100 kg will say, uh, but we have a fight here maybe. Uh, Dark Ranger here, she's doing just fine, she could, uh, did she charm something already? There, the, 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 this girl gets uh, staffed out. I'm not sure if she charmed anything. Oh, this knight maybe? A player's forces are under attack. One team is destroyed, yes. Only three teams left. Because uh, actually everyone is going out to fight. I guess they don't want to uh, tie anyway. <laughs> they don't want to play another game. I bet if they play another game, it's again going to turn out to be a five hour game. We have this yellow army here. This yellow army of uh, destroyers and mortar teams. And two tanks and a, a lot of tanks actually. So many tanks. I feel like this team has the most supply, right? 57 and... Uh, what's loose for it? 57 and 59. Yeah, there's 116 supply here for team yellow. Well, team light blue only has like what? 30 plus 35. 65 supply only. And team... Uh, team Loliath has a nice... Uh, 93 supply. So Team Yellow definitely in the lead. Although they do have mass destroyers and mass tanks. So, I mean, it's not that great of an army. Right? You rather want uh, an army like this with casters, a bit of everything. He has one witch doctor, one shaman. He has some berserkers, some uh, tauren, some tanks, some destroyers, some knights. A bit of everything. And a uh, dark ranger that can steal units. Or Lolite's army, which is also a bit of everything. Where is it? Where is it even? Here it is. He has some knights, some mortar teams, some superheroes, some uh, shredders. Great. What a truly intrig intriguing game we have here. These standoffs certainly blow my mind. The action when the raider hit the town hall was so insane. Just insane quality action that we have right here. Those are the words of one of my viewers. And... Uh, those are probably the thoughts of every one of you. He's probably not just speaking for himself when he, he was saying those words. Oh, Dark Ranger, did she steal something? Not yet, I think. She sells the staff. Or maybe she stole something and got killed. Big game is the most reasonable. Well, we have a fight here for uh, Hawk against Jamiko and everyone else is there as well, of course. No, never mind. We have uh, Team Hawk retreating. This tank here under a tank. Team Lucifer and Chamico, they haven't even spoken anything. It's only the other two that are just speaking. Chamico and uh, Lucifer is just gonna win this game. <laughs> They're like, you guys, you guys do your regame. We're gonna just own you guys. With the level 6 Fire Lords. Imagine those double volcanoes. Oh, it's gonna be so powerful. They did soft out the tank, saving the tank. Players' forces are under attack. Uh, <laughs> Hawk says middle. So a little light in the middle, but there's no one there. <laughs> 11 hour. Uh, 11 here. Here. 11 hour at the center. This is like me trying to set up a date with a girl. Like, 
and uh, just everything going wrong. I went AFK at around 35 minute mark. I see nothing changed in then. How long ago is that? How long ago was the 45 minute mark? Let me see. Oh, this radio again pillaging. It is now at the 92 minute. Are you guys kidding me? Are you what? <laughs> How long have we been in this game? Are you kidding me? 92 minutes. Are those real minutes? Oh, the radio here. The radio is uh, run, little radio. The radio takes so much damage. This all oh, those witch doctor dies. Team Light Blue is fall slowly falling apart. But are they gonna take the other teams with them? It seems only Team Yellow doesn't want to regame. The warden just blinking in. <laughs> no more two versus two versus two versus two game, please. <laughs> it is, it is uh, it's just one game. One game, guys. You guys cannot even handle one game. We've never done this before. I'm not sure if we'll ever see it again. This building over here that can be pillaged as well, but the radar went down again. If only this Dark Ranger had some boots. Go regame. Like Team Light Blue wants to regame. Team Blue wants to regame. It's uh, only uh, Team Yellow. <laughs> you see, <laughs> they sure with the no. They're like, Jamika and Lucifer. They they don't want to regame. They have the supply advantage. They have 4k lumber. They have. Uh... <laughs> Admin. <laughs> Admin say. You need to fight Korea if you're a scree or a ban. Foggy has seen enough. So we have a 58 supply and 59 supply. Still at 170 supply. Oh, did he just retrain? He just retrained. <laughs> he just retrained something. The depth of wood is retrained. Team Light Blue trying to bamboozle. Team uh, Dark Blue. Uh, you can see that uh, Luke Hawk, he's saying this, right? He's bamboozling uh, Team uh, Korea. And why can Hawk do this? Because he has the Dark Ranger. This is Hawk's Dark Ranger. So he's trying to use the Dark Ranger's charm to bamboozle the other two teams into fighting against each other. Go regame. Team Yellow doesn't want to regame. Oh, Team Yellow. The light is uh, using cute little smileys. Look at the smiley face. Oh, look at the smiley face there for cash. Hey, what just happened? Did I select something? Was there a unit there? I heard some sound. Napa dot. What, what does that mean? No, <laughs> Napa dot. <laughs> Why are you... Why are you Night Elf? Nap it out. Nap it out. Nobody nap it out. There's a lava spawn. Team Lucifer. Team Lucifer is going for... Uh... What's Team Lucifer going for? Team Lucifer, maybe they're gonna fight. Now without this attack, yes, okay. It's just that game, it's just one game. Napadot is a big booty girl. Soon Napadot. You want meet happy new year in this game? What? You want meet happy, oh happy. <laughs> He's saying like, uh, you wanna keep playing until new years? There's some mortar teams defending the main. What is team? Uh, where is the rest of the army? Oh, there they are. Well, one uh, one uh, thing went down. Oh, the destroyer is just killing the mortar teams in the back. And the tanks are just uh, defending the mortar teams. There's an illusionary blade master. Oh, the statue though. The destroyer is just uh, there's no con no one can kill the destroyers. 
Maybe they uh, team Chai Miko got tricked by team uh, team Light Blue, Blue by team Cash. Maybe they actually thought that they had to fight against the other Korean team, else they got uh, kicked out of the fight, uh, game. I'm not sure if they actually thought that, but uh, you know, this uh, fight, this fight is quite beautiful. I hear some. Uh, there goes the lava spawn. They cannot deal with the destroyers. Nothing here can attack the destroyers. It has one flying machine, and that's it. And he has the orb of fire, of course, on the fire lord. No, on the TC. On the TC. Okay, <laughs> catch the scouting. He's like, oh, there's Team Yellow. There's Team Lucifer. Lava spawn is uh, is down. The lava spawn is down. The warden, what she's doing here? Should just deep, uh, should just destroy yellow base, no TP, I think. There's a TP here on the Fire Lord for uh, Lucifer. Go, go, go. Well, Team Yellow doesn't want to fight two against one, so they're technically retreating here. In this angle, they, they cannot fight the two versus one. So both uh, blue teams, you know. <laughs> Are they going around the tree line? Go ob Obrizai or Obrizal. Go Obrizal. I'm not sure what that means, but uh, go go go. Team Light Blue is trying to walk. What are they doing? Walking around. Saying follow. <laughs> They're trying to hunt down Team Yellow. <coughs> Team Yellow, the only one that didn't want to draw, didn't want to regame. Team Light Blue walked around the, the trees. They go to Hawk's base. <laughs> oh, they're going back. They're, they're trying to kill uh, these blue units. Low light blue, blue units. Oh, there's the Blade Master going for a uh, oh, beautiful fight here, maybe. Except that uh, the light is just retreating. And uh, now they're going back north. This beautiful game here. Like the team light blue and blue want to sandwich this yellow army, but the yellow army don't want to be sandwiched. They want to fight one on one. This oh, the fire lord use the info potion. Thanks to a lot of damage there to the griffins, but uh, leaving five tanks behind is not that great. Oh, and here fake blade master has been silenced and uh, fork lightning, but he was just a fake. Tanks are being killed here. Fork lining here by a hog, but it only hits uh, Lolai's units. He's, he's still a unit of Lolayet, but he gets entangled. <laughs> Never trust the Dark Ranger, man. Never trust Hog. He just steals a unit. <laughs> hey, Hog. Uh oh. Hey. Sorry. <laughs> Misclick. <laughs> Misclick. Kappa, misclick. I think it's Jamiko. Jamiko's yellow. He doesn't have any knights. Jamiko didn't build a single knight this entire game. I don't think there was a... <laughs> Hawk is just lying. He's, he's just a liar. Okay, well, 10 minutes rest time. <laughs> Does he need heal up or something? Does he need to mana up? I don't know, he, need, he has plenty of mana. There's plenty of health. He just, he literally needs to rest in real life. There goes another pe uh, peasant. Let's see, let's look at the supplies one more time. So, uh, 52 and uh, 51, there's still 103 supply. <laughs> we fight their base. <laughs> Jamiko's base. Oh, here comes the Blade Master. Oh, no, the Warden. 248 critical strike. I mean, that's not the Warden, by the way. That's Naga. She gets staffed out. And, uh... 
Uh, team Light Blue is retreating. The warden here takes so much damage. Team Yellow is just fighting with their heroes only. But that's already too much to handle. And there goes a the Berserker. And there comes Team Blue. We <laughs> lose a Headhunter. <laughs> they should probably not be so close to each other. If they want to team this. Well, so far, beautiful game. Your timer has looped. Oh, yeah, I, <laughs> I remember making the timer thinking, hey, I'm never going to play a game that's longer than like how long? When did it loop? Like at 99 minutes? Never going to make uh, play a game that's longer than 99 minutes. I guess I did cast a game that's longer than 99 minutes. Dark Ranger here. Dark Ranger in trouble. She silences. She runs. And uh, the Dark Ranger is still alive. How can... Oh, she dies. Where's the rest of Light Blue's army? Is this all they have? Oh, the Naga was over here. The Warden was over there. Oh, Team Light Blue falling apart. They don't have much left. Without the Dark Ranger. They, they miss. They missed the charm. They lost all the charm. Oh, they are warden in trouble. The warden here. This warden for a hawk is still alive. Can, do they have money for more heroes? <laughs> they were behind. They're like, we came? There's no way Team Cash can win this, right? After losing that Dark Ranger, their only chance at winning this is a uh, regame, I guess. I mean, is there maybe a chance if these two other two teams cripple each other so much? All these heroes can attack air with the orbs of uh, fire flames. Go fight two versus two versus two in middle. <laughs> we don't have a hero. Heroes. They have a Warden and a Naga. Here comes Lucifer, Team Lucifer. Where are the tanks? Where are the Mortars? Are they coming with him? What they could do is just fight in the middle and send the tanks to kill all the bases. Hundred minutes in one hour, Kappa. <laughs> okay, well they are waiting. Uh, here's Team Blue is also waiting. They're just waiting for Team Lucifer. Team Lucifer, are they coming? They're just sitting here still. The Blade Master is checking. He sees, <laughs> he sees everyone waiting here at the center. Oh, he kills a berserker. Team Lucifer really wants to win this game. So what else? Not a Berserker. They're doing ev anything they can to win this game. Team uh, Team Blue, Team Lolliot, they just want to end this game. They want to eat chicken. Of course, they also want to win, but you know, the priorities are a bit different. Team Light Blue, they've just gone crazy. They don't know what they want anymore. There's a fan of knives. Oh, but the Warden, is she dead? She cannot blink. Oh, she has an info potion. The stomp there. T completely missed. Oh, the warden can be uh it's just gonna be fine you will blade master here killing shaman it seems like team uh this blade master is just killing unit for unit it's just uh, gonna kill team light blue it's gonna kill team uh cash is there more games after this one no not more uh <laughs> tournament games or show matches or anything really We'll, we'll cast some more Nettie's games after this. Probably. I'm not sure what time this game will end, actually. Maybe by the time this game ends, it's already 2018. And um, we'll see. There's the Warden again. Fan of Knives. Team uh, Blue is retreating here from Team Cash. I think uh, Team Blue could easily win this fight, right? They have like five, six heroes. 
They have uh, magic damage against Torin. Team Light Blue has no chance, and that's why they GG out. I'm not gonna watch Warcraft 3 for a week after this game. Uh, Go Rimworld. Uh, we'll do some Rimworld at the end of the stream, but. Um, For some netties, probably. Okay, well, uh, finally the uh, Team Yellow starts doing something again. Long distance mining with one peasant. It is now one versus one or two versus two. It's the same thing, right? Same thing. What's the game duration? Uh, 100 minutes plus whatever uh, is at the top right. Mikasa level 8. Great. Great. Everything going great. Oh. <laughs> uh, of course, you know, Team Loliath cannot can still not win out on the map. Let's look at the supplies. 64 plus, plus 16, right? So we... Where's your building? Yeah, so they have a beautiful 80 supply. Here at the other side, we have uh, 52 plus uh, 51. 103 supply. So a difference of like 20 supply. But no one can attack the destroyers. Not a single unit. Besides... The, oh, okay. The single unit can attack destroyers. And some heroes, of course. They, they do... Great job killing destroyers as well. We have the Orb of Fire here on the TC. We have the Orb of Fire here on the Warden. So they are the destroyer killers. This peon is surrounded. So wins only peon. Let me go. I guess there's no uh, shared control. Oh, there is actually, I think. So win has three heroes and a peon. That's what he's had for like the last one and a half hours. These knights. No knights. Cannon tower. GG guys, I need to make some food. I will see you all in an hour when another shaman has fun. <laughs> uh, okay, well there's still also this gold mine which has a beautiful 590 gold left. What sees it? Oh, the uh, sparkles. How do you call this again? I need to remember the name of this uh, this thing they're doing. I forgot again. I don't even remember anymore. It's, it's, it's not sparkle, right? It's um, flare. Oh yeah, flare. Flare. I never use that word, so every time I need to use it, I just can't remember. My mind just blanks. It's like... What is it again? Reveal? No, it's not reveal. It's flare. Uh, remove the names from the top. Oh, you're right. You're right. Okay, thanks for letting me know. Cash and Hawk, they're out of this game. Great. These are the players left. Chamiko and Lucifer in the yellow. Lolite and Serene in the blue. How much is on on the line? I think about forty dollars. So that's like what twenty dollars a person. Okay, well let's see. If we see, see some volcanoes. I want to see double volcano. Double volcano. Come on, show me, show me some volcanoes. Here comes Team Lucifer. Gonna kill Tower. <laughs> The light doesn't even fight. Where are the uh, griffins? Oh, there they are. They're hiding in the back. Uh, second tower also goes down. The story is here. Going for the for the warden, I guess. The warden blinks out. Is he still alive? Where's the volcano? No volcano yet. This oh, there's a healing. This uh, this fire lord. It takes his death. What's this guy doing? Oh, soul burning the healing guy. The keeper of the grove using the uh, healing. His tanks did a lot of damage to the the air units. Griffins. Destroyers. Still full hit points. They came from behind. There was the last flying machine has been killed. 
<laughs> this other uh, fire lord takes a lot of damage. These griffins now. Oh no, there was an. Oh no, there was a yellow flying machine there. It was Chimiko's uh, flying machine. The tanks just going for this town hall. The destroyers. No one can kill them. Oh, actually, the heroes. The heroes are going for the destroyers. Look at this. Uh, this damage here with the orb of fire. Doing so much splash damage. The griffins are f are running for their lives. These towers are going down. Well, without the, the destroyers here, this for TP's out. Oh wait a second! There's no TP on the Fire Lord. He's just dead, is he? Oh no, no mana, no mana on the warden. This other warden. Oh, she has plenty of mana. Does she not have blink or something? She is level eight. Of course she has blink. Maybe she should blink a few times to kill this Fire Lord, or at least try to. He has an info potion, of course, but. Uh, Meanwhile, what are the destroyers doing and the the griffins? I have no idea. Where did they go? Oh, here are the griffins. Where are the destroyers? These tanks are taking a lot of damage. Here are the destroyers. Maybe use your destroyers. Okay, they're gonna retreat. These tanks are dead. I mean, the hero heroes uh, are still all alive here for Team Loliath. Can Team Chimiko even rebuild their heroes? I guess Lucifer cannot rebuild his heroes. He doesn't have a building left. At least no uh, altar. Does he have not a single building left? No, but he's still in the game. Okay. That's great. So only three heroes here left for Team Yellow. A Fire Lord, a Blade Master, and a Death Knight. But they have destroyers. And Team Blue doesn't have destroyers. They do have uh, 59, 60, 74 supply or so. And the other team, they have 40, 40, 80, 86, 86 supply for Team Yellow. Okay, the sword is here going for the uh, shredder. There's towers here. Too many towers for Team Yellow to deal with. And the mortar team, actually, the mortar team's uh, no problem. The death knight here takes a lot of damage. Does he give the orb away before he dies? The warden, one of the wardens, have fallen level eight. So the only one warden left. Uh, the warden that has fallen was Sawin's warden. So she, she's never going to come back. Don't think that Lolai's warden will come back either because he's at zero gold as well. Uh, this warden now she's in danger. She gets a holy light, of course. She's still alive. I guess uh, holy lights have been amazing. The death knight, did he survive, by the way? Did the death knight die? This, uh, this fire door takes a bit of damage. Uh, Warden blinks out again. Griffins. But, oh, the griffins find the mortar teams. Mortar teams are dying so fast. Uh oh. But, uh, no, why are they not killing the mortar teams? Because he's microing something else. The fire lord has fallen. Now it's just a blade master, I think. Because I think the death knight's dead. So Blade Master uses Info Potion. He is level nine. When uh, Blade Master and Destroyers, of course, Destroyers are like cannot be killed by anything. And a Blade Master, oh, he got stomped. Is he going to die? He's fire, uh, fire, whatever. And uh, the Blade Master dies. GG. Team Loliath actually wins. Wow. Team Loliath wins, beating uh, beating Team Lucifer, of course. One is it? There. The light and so we let's look at this uh, end page here for a moment. So first of all, game time. Almost two hours. We didn't quite make it to two hours. Five more minutes. If they just waited around for five more minutes. Worker here. Did the worst, of course. Foggy did the second worst. Cash, Chamiko, Sawin. Look at this beautiful uh, distribution. Blue, yellow, light blue. Blue, yellow, light blue, red, red. This could be a beautiful flag of a country somewhere in uh, in Europe, of course. Okay, let's look. Units. Show me the units. So, uh, Cash made the most units. Okay. The Lion killed the most units. Chimiko built the most uh, buildings. That is no surprise. He built a lot of towers. But he also killed the most buildings. Also, no surprise, he went mass mortar teams with tanks. Okay, heroes, of course. Lolite with the superheroes. Sowin with also the superheroes. Uh, Lucifer. 
transfer with also quite superheroes. And of course, the other teams, not that strong heroes, okay. Uh, items obtained. Look, Lucifer, he got the most items, so we know also a lot of items. This is in this is probably including items you buy, right? So that's why uh, the Orc players probably... Wait, Lucifer he was on that. Okay, but he has a Blade Master. I, you know, they have more items. Great. Resources. Gold mine. Law Lyot. So much more. Look at him. Look at how much gold he actually mined. Compared to Chamico and Lucifer, who for so long had so many bases, but they didn't mine because they uh, went over 80 supply and they went, didn't want to mine anymore. So Lolite actually just mined so much, but his teammates win only 20,000. So in total, it's only 65, which is still more than Chamico and Lucifer. Cash and uh, Hawk mined a little bit. Okay, great. Great, resources traded. Look at Loliath giving so many resources to Soin. And Soin only giving so little back. Wow. Soin is a taker and Loliath is a giver. These other teams are a bit more even. At least the uh, yellow teams are even. Chaimiko and uh, Lucifer are pretty even. Or relatively even. Hawk. Cash and Ma. Oh, Foggy Orc Worker just not trading at all. Tech percentage, 70% here for Hawk and Loliat. 3% for Foggy, great. Cold loss to upkeep. 15k here for Loliat. Okay. Well, that was a great game. Which team won? Loliat and Sawin won. It's the only team that's left uh, on top. They earn a nice uh, like $45 or so, or $40 together.